Have you been to Sacramento yet? Hell no, I ain't going out there unless I'm with CML. We, we ain't get, I'm out of bounds, baby, on the gang. I ain't going with Chito. I ain't going with them. I ain't going with nobody. I stay down south. I'm, I was, I was going to say, like, if you get booked up there, are you going to take the booking or no? I'm taking the straps. I'm taking the straps. I ain't going out there. I'm way out of bounds. I wouldn't want to even touch grounds right there. Oh. I wouldn't. People on the blog saying that, oh, he's Disney Norte. So what? I am Disney Norte, and I would never go up there. I'm not stupid, and you would never come down here. Well, I've noticed like a lot of the a lot of the OGs are uniting from the I, south I, and the north. I don't want to speak on the OGs. I don't speak on prison politics. Prisons, prisons, the streets is the streets. But I talk about music. We're talking music wise. Whatever they got going, hey, I, I listen to that. My politics are different. I don't speak on that. Right. So what I speak on though is music wise. People say Norteños are better than South Side rappers. This is for music. They're not. They're not. They're hard. I don't bump none of this stuff. You know what I'm saying? And they stay dissing the homies. So why is everybody all bugger that I'm saying, fuck them? Because they stay dissing us. You know what I'm saying? They stay dissing us, calling us. You know what I'm saying? That's cool. So each is his own. I'm going to make music from my side. Hey, shout out to the World, man. Blue Devil. I like the way he puts it. He just keeps it real, dog. And he makes me see it the way that I see it, but I just can't get the words out. But he's just like, I would, it's a big topic. It's everybody saying Lefty says I, w I would never do a song with him. I would never go up there and go to their side of town. And I don't think they would ever come down south. I never seen a Norteño. Oh, never mind. I'm not gonna say nothing. It's another subject. I never, I never leave it like that. My question to you is: uh, I know you have been putting out a lot of videos, a lot of singles, freestyles. Are you working on an album right now? Yeah. Fuck rap, dog. I think about it right there, just drinking, just looking at it, like. Fuck rap. Rookie of the year. And I'll still sell it out. That's the album. The album's called Rookie of the Year. It's hard. So the album's called Rookie of the Year. Rookie of the year. It's the best shit that I ever wrote in my life. They got my sound out of me. All this shit you guys think is hard? Hell no. Nah. You get a preview with like the Grifo stuff. Just the, the, the Cheeto flow. Like Those are like the songs they just add. Ah, and they're getting like 150,000, 70, 80,000 in one day on YouTube. I trip out. What, hey, how much does uh, Start From Scratch got right now? Please, while I do it. Yeah, Rookie of the Year, man. Lefty Gunplay by OTR Records. Produced by Zay Keys. South Treasy, Matt Bricks. Uh, Cypress. What features you got? Oh man, I got Big Sad 1900. Mm -hmm. I got Drummer Boy. I got King Cash. I got 9,000? That ain't shit. It's probably more than that. That ain't nothing. It probably, the views ain't caught up yet. You got to look at it from the YouTube nah, studio. He shit. knows. He knows. Erase it. And that sounds hard. I want to hear it right now. Yeah, it's just hard. Hey, no. Um, Big Sad, Lil Weirdo, Lil Maru. Um, Shout out to San Diego. Shout out to Lil Maru. We're doing the baby. I can't keep my eyes off you. And I'm Are you so serious? Hypnotized, but he's writing what he's writing. And I'm going, I got a thing for the five. Big Gemini? Five twos, rock and rock, packs you in the letter. Yeah. That was the Big we're Gemini record, right? Remix that, that beat. And uh, that's the song that I told him I wanted him on. I see him on it, and I think he's going to do numbers. Him singing. So when you, when you do that record, you got to hit a Big Gemini to get it cleared? You got to just remake the beat, dog, to whoever can make the beat better. Memorize it in your dog. Are y'all clearing room. the big Gemini sample? Yep. Yeah, through George, New Mexico. Yeah. They said it's good. That's just hard. That's a classic. That's gonna do money. Y'all gotta remake some MB Rider shit. No. no. MC Magic shit. No. Nope. That, that say, baby. No, I know, but I'm saying you should also remake I don't want some to. MC. Like, did you ever grow up listening to MC Magic? All my home? girls did. All my mom did. My mom and all her own girls did. Yeah. That's like the girls and the mom stuff. Like, uh, nah, I can't. Oh, yeah, I should do it for the people. Why not? For the culture. Yeah. For the culture. They would really like that. Shout out to other girls that grew up listening to that. And or I know even some like, oh, you should you should do a freestyle. Hey, you know what? We're going to have you freestyle before you leave over, I'm going to pick the beat. Let me hear it. Which would be? We're going to do neighborhood music. A little Robbie? Yeah. I think that would be hard. Damn, that one's going to be hard to do. And then like then some. All right. Or we could do summer nights. That's it? No? Or, or neighborhood. Neighborhood Oh, I could music. do it like that. I like this song. Uh, neighborhood. It's all good. We'll get to that later. It'll be. A I want to do it right video. now already. Well, no, nah, it'll be a different YouTube. I met Lil Rob. I met Lil Rob the other day, man. Shout out to Lil Rob, man. He the uh, OG, man. OTR took me over there to a to a Lil Rob concert on a Sunset Boulevard in Melrose. Yeah. Um, he took me. I met him. He was real humble. He's just like real, like just a homie, you know. Super humble. I met Saboy local too. Like Saboy, Saboy's cool. Dog. Sabu he's cool as fuck too. Yeah. He's really cool. Yeah. He's like gang, gang. Like he's just like hood with it. Like he's just he is what he like. He says he's just like he's he's a gangster. Sabo's a gangster. Like you meet him in person, you'll be like, "Oh shit, he a gang." He a real one recognize real. He he a, he a low. Like he a gangster. You know, what I always wondered is, I didn't think he was gonna be like that. 
I, he surprised the fuck out of me. He's really like that. Like he's just really tripping. Sabo loco. I met him randomly backstage at a YG concert in Arizona before he went to jail the last time. He's cool, huh? Cool. I mean, he was cool, yeah. He looked like a homie, like just a homie. Yeah. That's Sabo loco. Shout out Sabo loco and YG Fawn. Uh, I was gonna recipe slim, man. I was gonna ask you, yeah, R.I.P. to Slim Four Hundred. Uh, for you, like being in the shoe, I yeah. wonder mentally, what do you do to not go crazy? When you're in that sort of confinement, man, because I just went it's crazy meant to break man. you, right? It did, it did. And I didn't even do that long in there. People did 20, 30 years. No, I don't want to say too much on it. I did two, three years. I didn't get no phone, no, no soups, no do none you of that. Mentally, like, are you able to mentally go on a vacation and remove? I think Pelican Bay shoe was like more boring than Cork and Shoe. Cork and Shoe, I had like a good time in there. Cork and Shoe was just like just cool. Yeah. It's just like it's like you just got to be ready for your shit. But Cork and Shoe just. Cork and shoe. You just gotta go to cork and shoe to no cork and shoe. No words can explain it. I've been to cork and shoe. I went to cork and shoe for like, you know, young. Grew up in cork and shoe. 18, 19, 20. Boom. Transferred Pelican Bay shoe. Year and a half, boom, hit the line. Doo -doo 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 -doo. But I was a cork and shoe. So it was cool right there, dog. It's just like a different type of time in my life, fool. Like just right. really fucked me up. Just really made me better. Just I just tripped out on it. I look back at it like Oh, that shit fucks you up, though. Like, it's just like, it's a trip. It made me who I am. And I got no regrets, but yeah, I was in cork and shoe. Has it, has it been hard? Like, how long did it take for you if you even have it adjusted to, like, being out? I don't think I could do cork and shoe over again. It was just like that, that, that was like that vicious. Like, you just got to have the heart for the first time and do it one time. And that's it. It's just cork and shoe breaks, motherfuckers. Like, it's just good homies. And the homies right there are just real tight, but... Corkin shoes just corkin shoe. I don't miss that thing. I do not. And then how how hard is it be being out? Learning how to adapt. Is that what you ask me? Yeah. Learning how to adapt. Uh, um, being so institutionalized, still being in the hood. Just yeah, I got a bag. I got money, but money don't last forever. Like you know, I took care of my needs. And uh, right now I got an apartment, and I'm just waiting to sign. I don't know why my mom. She's like just lagging the sign, but. Yeah, just I gotta get it out of the hood. I'm dying to get up out the hood. Like people want to be hood so bad. I'm I don't want this no more. I'm always gonna be hood to keep a ghetto drive to the hood. But man, like don't. But get that's it also where you're the most vulnerable at. The hood is always the hood. Don't ever take it for granted, dog. Like you live by the gun, you die by the gun. I'm not stupid. I'm really gangster, and God already wrote the script. You can't be scared. When you go, you go. Just when it's your time, it's your time. And if you're not asking for trouble, you just, you know, on your lonely on some gang shit, you be all right. But if you're out there looking for trouble, trouble won't find you. Dead homes, I don't care what area you in. Like, you know what I'm saying? You in the county, you on the streets, you on in another person's hood, you be popping it for you. You better be walking it. Like, mm -hmm. fools out there ain't playing. I don't get it twisted. People out there ain't playing. I wasn't playing. You know what I'm saying? It, it's, it's bad out here in LA too. Like, you know what I'm saying? But it's also good. But if you look for trouble, you're going to find trouble. To the kids doing it, like, don't do that. Like, listen to your mom. This is bullshit. And and are you, do you feel like you're moving in a way in which, like, hey, I'm, I'm staying? Yeah, I'm like, like you know, you, you don't want to, you don't, you don't want to end up. No, it hurts. Back or even dead, you know? I don't give a shit though. Like, yeah, I don't care if I ended up dead or ended up back. I don't. I'm not doing that. I'm being smart about it. I know I got shit going on for me for myself. But if something were to happen and that happened, fuck it. That's what happened. That's the way the script went. And we're, we're doing everything not to do that. And that's the part that's hard of me. As long as you're doing those things, it's right? It's hard though. That, no, that's why I got to tap pat myself in the back and, and back. And nobody gives me that credit. Like them two steps back. Mm -hmm. Like not kicking it with the hood. To, um, not, being, not selling dope no more. Right. You can't sell dope and rap. That's bullshit. Because you're going to be strapped, serving up sacks all day. You'll never get in the zone. You want to rap, you got to sacrifice and be broke, dog. And write them bangers Grind. in jail and just believe in your dream, dog. Yeah. And stop being selling dope. Dope's cool. Selling dope's cool. You, I never made it past fucking $500,000 $1, in my pocket to where I was just breaking even every day. And just, you know, had a brand new shirt and a chain. And Maybe a, some shoes. a beamer. Yeah. I had a beamer. You know what I'm saying? But a but, haircut. But nothing, no real wealth. Nothing. That's the same thing yeah. every weekend. I heard, that's all I had, but I had money though. Right. But now I got money. 